Hello YouTube! Here's Jumac again with another Battlefield Bad Company 2 commentary. This time not on Isla, we uh, went to Atacama. And as you can see here, I could have stabbed this guy, but I had absolutely no idea that when I enter a game, we would have people on our spawn, people with our chopper, and nobody on our team. We joined in this, what? is pretty much a uh, dream squad from my friends list. Uh, it was uh, the first time I played with uh, Russell Muscle. <laughs> a very, very good player. Um, and as you can see, the beginning is not very optimistic. But, I, you know, usually I would be very, very pissed off at this moment. But I knew that I'm with Russell and he's able to take down Apache, so uh, Hint would not be much of a deal. Uh, but you can see the opposing team has got everything. They got our chopper, they're sitting on the VATs, they have two people up front um, in front of our spawn, they uh, have snipers at the back using mortars, they essentially have, <laughs> have us where they wanted. I'm surprised I uh, I live long enough to hit the chopper, um, you know, because I'm being fired at from snipers, from the two guys on the left, uh, RPGs are coming at me, and uh, the guys in the chopper were not super good, because right now you can see that I can actually manage to hit it. Poof. But of course they got armor, and I didn't take uh, explosive part two. Um, and so at the beginning, there's a lot of fail. I uh, simply ran out of uh, AT4s, and uh, quietly await uh, <laughs> for us to take take him down uh, as you can see I don't really want to get out of here because I'm being shot at from everywhere miss this one close but no cigar and then there's mortars coming on my head which is also lovely this was a very bad shot I don't know how about you but sometimes I get in the in the right uh, mood for 84s things are working out and sometimes I just can't hit a thing with it let's see snipers having fun around my head and yeah, I'm surprised I'm alive so I run out of 84s and wonder what to do next so I'm like I'm gonna t no <laughs> I'm gonna go back uh, try to make it hard for the snipers um, and right, yeah, you can hear the sniper coming at me, and I'm like, what? Or now I'm gonna take a, an armored vehicle, boof, and explodes in my face. So, yeah. But at this moment, Arasso actually takes down the chopper. He takes the um, uh, explosive Mark II and takes it down in one shot. And, um,. So I changed my loadout uh, to salt with uh, smoke and uh, the ACOG scope and <laughs> avoid the mortar and just uh, try to go alone on the left side to scout for these two guys that were up front. Here's one, miss him. Here's the other one, there's him too. Of course I uh, tell my squad mates where they are. And I was aiming to, to you know, hide behind the dune. I thought that the guys, the two guys are shooting at me, but it was actually butts. You can't hide from the butts. I wish one was uh, on Oasis for Rush. Uh, but anyway, um, I think this is the point where we actually start doing work. Um, 
there's five of us now. My friend Lux joins as the uh, fifth person. So we get we have a dream team on our side. We still have more people on the opposing team, but that makes absolutely no difference. So I'm still trying to scout out those two guys, spot them for for Boss, who's sniping on the right hand side, but sadly from from his viewpoint, he can't take a shot. So I'm wondering what to do now. Uh, so I'm just to pick out that guy and I get sniped. Well, sniped. M14 uh, from the guy up front, and uh, we finally got the chopper. And um, I call this clip Karma because uh, these guys really destroy the heck out of them. So my role is to die, uh, no, my role is to arm the crates and uh, I try doing that, fail many times, okay, look around here, I'm beeping here, yeah, this is the sniper, I managed to take him down, and arm the crate, Take this spot. I, I like this spot. I was told that there's a guy on the left, so I'm gonna help. I managed to not shoot this guy. I'm surprised that I'm still alive. They were all exposed, I mean, exposed from, from the left side. But um, I think, you know, the, uh, they, they do this arm. But we had we had the chopper up, up there, and uh, when there's not enough players like this, it's a real advantage. So I felt this. I should have prioritized them the other way. Uh, but as you can see, Araso immediately takes him down with the chopper. I choose to go with with boss here, so we can both work um, on the ground. I see the the vehicle there, but he's already dead, and I I, I, I just couldn't grasp why why the vehicle would be moving, and there's nobody in there. So I still you can still see me scope it up. Where the hell is that guy? Didn't manage to get this guy, and I expected him to wait for me, but he did not. He was one of the few lower ranks in there. Got lucky there too because they're looking at uh, at the chopper. That's that's one great thing. Um, when you know they worry about the chopper, they're very vulnerable. I guess I'll arm it, but it uh, goes down. So that was a, the, the quick first uh, two crates. And you can see we, we still played at five people. So I felt very good about that. Armed both crates and uh, and we destroyed them, even though they had twice as many players. So that was good. But of course they're still camping somewhere at the back. They did not realize that we're actually pushing forward. So it's not exactly twice as many players, but I just want to make it make us more uh, more beastly players than we are. <laughs> okay, so we boss went for arming Bravo. I worry about the VADs. Got the chopper guys. Yeah, I don't think that anybody actually went for for disarm on the Bravo crate. Lots of them were still on the previous set of bases, and uh, they worry about the, about the chopper, so they try to get to the uh, to the hot. So they got Bravo easily, and then I'm going for Alpha. You know, I'm being a little careless with just you know, going for it without looking, but I play like that <laughs> all the time. I was gonna 
camp up this place, but I guess they did see me. Uh, yeah, I do manage to hide, but his pal knows about me. But he worries about the chopper and not the crate. Although they would have, you know, had Good work. Uh, cover. I don't know why. In any case, the chopper has been a super, super help in there. We, we could not probably do it without it. Well, definitely couldn't do it without it. So cheers to that. Yep, that's try to get rid of the vats as much as I could. Okay, charge is up. Stand by. This was interesting. There's a, I mean, this guy clearly comes out, and uh, I see the the vats, but he knew about me, so I go Rambo against the vats and <laughs> manage to kill him. It was very unlikely in every other situation but then i fell hor horribly uh, i don't think that was the guy that actually disarmed and then i get taken out i actually do a a, a good thing here but um, i should have turned left when i get up the stairs because he was looking for me and i looked on the right i thought he's gonna be there and yeah I could have gotten him if I was a little smarter, but it's me. So again, I, I uh, try to get rid of the vats, although the guy who was sitting behind it is already gone by, uh, I think Luke's got him. Alright, so it's time to uh, kick some butt, arming crates, killing dudes in their base again. Um, I uh, kill these guys because they worry about the, the chopper, even though the other one was assault, so I don't know what... Oh, maybe I'm just seeing things. Uh, in any case, I managed to arm the crate, and I got lucky because I don't know, they probably wanna, wanted to steal my dog tags. But he was like 50 meters away. I do get the bots for my dudes there and get taken out immediately. But um, it means the the bots is the biggest threat. I actually don't do it when we. Uh, uh, well, pretty soon, uh, pretty soon in, in here, I spawn on the chopper again uh, and I get uh, the gunner seed, which I do not want because. Uh, you know, it's a, uh, the the gunner actually went and, and started repairing, so that would be very very unfair to steal the gunner seat, especially when I probably wouldn't do as much as a good good job there. Kill this guy, but uh, at this point I was looking for because I knew that they were camping around, but. Uh, at some point now, the, uh, we'll the bots uh, respawns, I mean, you know, appears again. And uh, instead of camping it, I don't know what I was trying to do there, I should have taken it out. Uh, we take the tank with, with Rasa together. And uh, at this point, I should have shot it. I didn't, and I get shot in the back because the guy was really camping that building that I thought he would be. And he takes the vats. And at this point, I, of course, uh, inform Russell about that, but uh, there was a little slight miscommunication. He thought it's this one. 
I wish I immediately uh, mentioned that it's the other one. And I try to take it down from from the ground, but it's already already dead before I get there. So we quickly uh, move forward um, and seize the area around Alpha. I don't do particularly well, but uh, boss does manage to arm it, I think. But at least that's what I wanted him to do. I think he does, yeah. Maybe, maybe a blueberry. Yeah. And. Uh, successfully blows up but uh, from now on I don't get a kill I think I'm just madly, uh, running around and uh, I think more people joined our team at this point so we couldn't uh, just brag about being really a stronger team because at the end uh, it was really a, a full squad of I don't know how many generals it was really a dream team I screw up here yeah I don't know yeah, yeah, it's me me with a knife <laughs> I get taken out I sped up the end because uh, I didn't want to edit it out although we can probably not make anything out of it uh, we simply uh, you know pushed forward at least I did uh, you know head on failed jumping up there you can't really do that um, and then I just tried to survive because we had everyone in there and lots of really good players joined in and uh, so it was really just uh, car might work the same situation that we faced at the beginning they faced at the end so in a typical fashion I died <laughs> at the end to, to, to stare at the winning screen while being dead and I wasn't really doing much work at the end but it was a good match uh, my KD was horrible because I just went to arm the crates and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you around soon. Bye-bye.